What's up, fans? What's going on? NASA has just discovered seven new planets. Yes. Like, it looks like I'm out of here, man. I'm about to get in my rocket ship with the little Einsteins, and I'm about to blast off. No, but, <laughs> but all seriousness, watch this video, and I think you guys will definitely be amazed. This is insane information. I'm excited to announce today that Dr. Mikel Gion and his team have used our Spitzer Space Telescope to determine that there are actually seven Earth-sized planets orbiting the nearby TRAPPIST-1 star about 40 light years away. What's more, as you can see in this illustration, is that three of these planets, marked in green, are in the habitable zone where liquid water can pool on the surface. In fact, with the right atmospheric conditions, there could be water on any of these uh, planets. So for the first time, we found as many terrestrial planets around a single star, and that's the first time we have been able to measure, in addition to that, both the masses and the radii of these habitable zone-type Earth-sized planets. These planets are among the best uh, in, in, of all the planets we know to follow up, to see, for example, with the James Webb Space Telescope that we're going to launch last year, the atmospheres, and also to look at biosignatures, if there are any. The discovery gives us a hint that finding a second Earth is not just a matter of if, but when. Scientists believe, actually, that around every star there could be one planet. Take three, take five, take seven. And you can just imagine how many worlds are out there that have a shot to becoming a habitable ecosystem that we could explore. And what we really have in this story is a major step forward towards answering one of these very questions that are at the heart of so many of our philosophers of what we're thinking about when we're by ourselves. And that basically is, are we alone out there? We're making a step forward with this, a leap forward, in fact, towards answering that question. And I'm really excited. This is insane, guys. Seven new Earth-like planets that could house life. Like, that's just insane, right? What if we went to one of these planets <laughs> and we're there and we see our twins? Like, that would just be so freaking freaky. Now, these people strongly believe that one day they're going to be able to find another planet Earth. They said it's just a matter of when it's going to be done. And I think that's insane. I just wonder what's going to happen if we do find another planet Earth, right? I mean, are we going to see situations where people start to go crazy and the planet's going to be auctioned off to the highest bidders for cash. And they're just going to leave all of us poor people here. And the top 1% go to a different planet. Like, what's going to happen? I can see something like that happening, man. You guys let me know what you think about this in the comment section below. And I'll see you guys later. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. I'm Thomas Live. And I'm out.